The Chinese People's Liberation Army, PLA Army, has just tested the Type 625E short-range air defense system which is predicted to be the closest competitor to the Russian Panzer S-1 system. This mobile air defense system will begin rolling out in 2022, developed by China South Industries Group Corporation, CSGC, and China North Industries Group Corporation, Narinko. The Type 625E is designed to address the short-range air defense Shorad, gap in the PLA Army's multi-layered air defense strategy. The system is equipped with weapons in the form of a 25mm six-barrel Gatling cannon, with an effective range of up to 2.5 kilometers and a maximum altitude of 2 kilometers. This weapon is capable of countering a wide range of air threats, including aircraft, helicopters, cruise missiles, loitering munitions, and other low-flying drones. This system can also play a secondary role in ground combat against enemy armored vehicles and protective structures. The missile system components consist of two blocks containing four FN-16 air defense missiles with a maximum range of 6 kilometers. The missile is designed to intercept targets at low and very low altitudes with high maneuverability, capable of 18 grams rounds. However, in some configurations, the system can also carry the FB-10 missile, which has a longer range of up to 10 kilometers and can target threats at an altitude of 15 meters to 5,000 meters. The system is mounted on an eight-wheeled, high-mobility chassis, similar to the ZBLO eight-wheeled infantry fighting vehicle, providing high mobility over a wide range of terrain, enabling rapid deployment and repositioning in response to battlefield needs. The Type 625E has a front engine layout with a large control room next to the cabin, and the center section houses the combat module with integrated weapons systems. For targeting and detection, the Type 625E combines a search radar, tracking radar and optoelectric tracking system, making it capable of detecting and tracking low-flying aircraft, drones, helicopters and cruise missiles. After detecting a high-speed incoming target, the search radar provides target indication information, directing the tracking radar and optoelectric system to the target position. The system then intercepts and tracks the target, with the tracking and stabilization controller performing real-time calculations to ensure stable tracking. This allows the Type 625E to reliably seek and track targets on the move, accurately measure distances, stabilize artillery and automatically adjust firing parameters. During combat, the ship's fire control system continuously tracks targets, calculates their trajectories and determines the best interception positions, thereby controlling the artillery targeting them. Additionally, the system is equipped with an infrared optical sensor, which allows it to attack multiple targets simultaneously via an infrared camera feed. Although the Type 625E is often compared to the Russian Panzer S-1 system, the Panzer S-1 or its latest variant Panzer SM offers greater range and advanced radar capabilities compared to the Type 625E. The Panzer S-1 integrates a dual 30mm autocannon and a 5.7E6E missile with a strike range of up to 20 km, while the Panzer SM with a 5.7E6ME missile offers a range of up to 30 km and increased radar detection of up to 75 km.